cold. I know, I know it is. Temperatures are running about 10 to 20 degrees colder than yesterday at this time. So uh, as you leave the house for work or school, get ready for temperatures around 30 this morning and afternoon temp around 45 degrees. That means jackets, sweaters, sweatshirts, the warmer clothes. That's what you're going to want for today and tomorrow as well. I mean, we've got two back to back very similar days. Afternoon high of about 45 coming your way in Boston, 46 in Worcester, 47 in Manchester, New Hampshire. We've got mid 40s down to Brockton, Bridgewater in Plymouth, and we've got a windy day across Cape Cod with highs in the low to mid 40s. Yeah, there's a little bit of a breeze that you're going to find from time to time in the Boston area, but down here, Cape and Islands, you guys are windy for the next couple of days. It takes much longer for your winds to subside overnight tonight uh, low 26 yes it's going to be cold tomorrow let's do it again rewind repeat and 46 degrees in fact over the next two days that cold weather is set to peak you can see we've got a nice little climb as we head into friday and the weekend as well uh, as far as what we're going to be watching the chances for rain are definitely going down. I do think that we're going to get a period of some clouds coming through, especially Friday night. It won't be as chilly, but we are watching the coastline for those usual spots, seeing a little splash over some minor coastal flooding. It's the combination of the astronomical high tide and a nearby low pressure. We were hoping that this was going to be a little closer and swing in some more rain as it looks like uh, Maine is a lucky spot that gets some um, rain relief. Otherwise, you're going to see as we go from Friday afternoon into Saturday, no more than the chance for like a little lonely sprinkle at the coastline. Uh, most of the weekend is going to be partly sunny. It's going to be dry. As you saw, it's going to get warmer as we go. We're going to have to watch this Monday front. Hopefully we get some rain as that comes through. But even now that rain looks fairly scattered. It doesn't look like much seven day forecast weekend always in view. Chilly Wednesday and Thursday by Friday temperatures start to climb a little bit. We'll get that wave of clouds uh, with that nearby low pressure, but I'm not expecting much in the way of rain at all. Back to you.